place in my heart where you live Wrapped up in boxes, hoping I would forget But I didn't, I didn't It didn't work You're dragging me down, pulling me under We're in a storm, I'm the lightning I can't make you go away, can't get you out of my brain Tonight And I care more for you than you do for me That's just how it's always gonna be about to eat my breakfast that I've just prepared. I just wanted to quickly sit down and talk to y'all and say that um, life has been a little bit weird the past few weeks. I'm moving back to the States in about three weeks. My time in Sweden is coming to an end. I had really just been feeling very strongly that I wanted to keep as many private moments for myself that I could um, and Kind of just be present so i haven't been filming as much and on top of that i'm wrapping up my thesis and there's a lot still yet to do just in putting in the finishing touches and preparing my defense and things like that so life has just been life has been a little weird feeling but also incredibly boring because i've just been at the library all day every day um, after the library, I go sit in the park and then I come home and that's been my routine these past few weeks Just a lot of uh, thesis work. So that's why I haven't really been uploading lately. So basically what I'm trying to say is um, Sorry for being MIA lately. That's why in these next few weeks my videos are probably gonna be a little bit more sporadic, um, not very structured um, You know, this video is just a very relaxed kind of like what I've been doing lately and what I've been eating lately and clips that I've filmed here and there. As always, I appreciate your continued support and kindness. And yeah, I hope that you uh, enjoy the rest of this video. Just wanted to say hi. So uh, yeah, that's all. What makes you smile? Meet me on the street lights. me where the lights fade out Tell me what it feels like Tell me what you're thinking about Hello everyone. I am sorry if my voice is sounding a little scratchy. I just woke up, but I needed to get this voiceover done. Um, so I'm actually recording this voiceover from the States. I moved back a while ago now, and these clips were also filmed a while ago. I have a couple more videos to post from Sweden, and then I'll be switching over to filming here, so that's really exciting. Um, but yes, this is just a very quick breakfast that I had. Uh, this is just some sweet potato with some tofu crumbled in. I mixed in some cherry tomato and some spinach and served that up with some salsa and enjoyed that. I'm also getting into another very simple meal. I'm just making some potatoes. I seasoned those up with some salt and some lemon pepper. And we're also going to add in some nutritional yeast, some leftover chickpeas, and some kale, which I massaged beforehand. 
adding a bit more seasoning with some cumin and some chili powder and then we're just going to chop up some toppings got some cherry tomato some red onion and some avocado we're serving this up with some rice we got our potato chickpea kale mixture and we're just going to top it off with you know our uh, our veggies and our avocado and a little bit of salsa and enjoy Very simple dinner tonight. <laughs> Tomato sauce. Lemon pepper. Lemon juice. They want to take me away Throw me in the backseat rainy day Made me promise I wouldn't say If it was up to me you know I would have stayed I know I've mostly just been making toast for breakfast lately. That's genuinely the only thing I've been having for breakfast for, I don't know, maybe like a month now. I haven't really been eating anything else, just some sort of toast or bread, occasionally a breakfast taco or like a tofu scramble. But why am I out of breath? I've been stressed with my thesis, getting it done. Um, it's a good kind of stress. I've been stressed thinking about moving home, but again, it's mostly a good kind of stress. I've really been in the mindset of like going into the grocery store, getting the things that are budget friendly, pretty much getting the things that I always get. I always know what I'm going to need when I go to the grocery store and that creative sort of energy surrounding food has not been super present for me lately because I feel like I'm pouring a lot of my mental energy into finishing up my thesis, which has also been... I'm also very emotionally invested in the thesis, so it's taken up it's taken up a lot of my time, a lot of my day, and just a lot of my mental, emotional capaci capacity. So I hope that y'all um, can understand and just, if nothing else, this can be an example of it's okay to kind of stick to the bare basics whenever you're um, when you're feeling a little bit stressed and you just want to be able to go into the grocery store, get the same things you always get, and be in and out and not spend too much time in the kitchen because that's really where I've been lately. So yeah, I'm gonna eat this now. Okay. Are you fighting me? You're not supposed to 
Oh my gosh, my voice really is so scratchy. I just listened to the rest <laughs> last recording I did. I'm really sorry about that. But I am making a rice noodle dish here. I'm just cutting up some veggies nice and thin. I got some carrot, some ribbon carrot, some cucumber, some onion, and some spinach. We're putting some rice noodles in some hot water to cook up, and we're also going to be cooking up some tofu, making a sauce with some hot sauce, some soy sauce, some sesame seeds, some agave, and a little bit of water. And we're just going to add our noodles in with this uh, add our sauce and toss that around the best that you can probably helpful if you have some tongs but i didn't back in sweden um, i'm topping it off with my tofu and any leftover sauce and this has been one of my absolute favorite meals lately Another super simple meal here. You can have this for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. Um, so simple, it probably doesn't even need a voiceover, but I'm making one anyway. This is just some potatoes with some veggies, um, some black beans. I got kale and some peppers in there. Gonna let those cook, and I just serve this up with some toast on the side with a little bit of hummus. Um, I probably would have put more on the toast, but I was low on groceries that day, and hummus was all I had, so yeah. I don't know if you still love me, but I still feel the same For what it's worth, that's how I feel today So will I float like leaves do in the wind? Or will I sink as soon as I jump in? Or should my feet will touch the ground? I can't do this with one hand. I need to have a bite of my ice cream as soon as I get home because it's all like soft and nice when you get home. You know? Mm. Oh my gosh. This is our last meal of the video. I'm making some gnocchi, gnocchi with a bunch of veggies, just some mushroom, some pepper, some onion, some zucchini, and some broccoli. So I'm getting all of that into my pan. This would probably be, be better if you um, adjusted the cooking time, like maybe added in your broccoli and onion and carrot first, um, later added the mushroom, but 
I just dumped it all in there at once. Um, so then after they had cooked down for a while, I added in some tomato sauce and some water, added in my gnocchi and seasoned everything up with some nutritional yeast, a little bit of hummus, definitely have some other seasonings in there, like some salt, some lemon pepper, some garlic powder, maybe some oregano I usually put in this. Um, and yeah, I just served this up and enjoyed. I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'm sorry it was a little bit random and not really well organized, but that's just, that's the accurate reflection of my life at this time and still. So um, yeah, I hope that you enjoyed and I'll see y'all very soon for the next one.